Texas with a double header against New Mexico. Game number one, second inning. Longhorns offense going to work in this one with a little bit of help from the Lobos defense. Yeah, you see Papelka get on there. That's two outs right now. Shannon Rhodes gets one cross on a hit and run, gets the RBI. Mackenzie Parker falls it up with an RBI single. Then it's Mary Iacopo, two runners on. She goes yard. This one a 3 1 run blast to get Texas up. And number 10 on the season for Iacopo, one in front of Shannon Rhodes and Longhorns home run race and Ariana Adams took care of the rest in the circle. She was absolutely brilliant in five innings allowing zero hits and the game capped off right there by Caitlin Washington's grab the 51st no hitter in Texas history the first of Ariana Adams career in a 12 nothing Texas win. How would they follow that up game number two of the doubleheader the series finale New Mexico jumping on top early. Couple singles in a row here by the Lobos. This one goes in the form for Lobos way and hear about that heads up base running gets their first run across. They're up one nothing against Texas. Yeah it was the second time in the three games of this series they led after two but Texas finally responds in the third Taylor Ellsworth with the home run a blast to left field and the Longhorns offense would get going. Yep you see you got a runner on here. A little bit of a miscue. They're going to call that a hit, but Texas lower half the lineup getting runners on, getting them over, and they're able to continue the run rally against New Mexico. Yeah, you saw MK Tedder there who went four for four in her first start of the season in the fourth inning. Lauren Burke with the walk. Colleen Sullivan having a career year at the plate, drives home a run with an RBI double as Burke scores. And the Longhorns started to break this one open. They would put up two in the third, two more in the fourth. Caitlin Washington with an RBI single. And we move on to the fifth, where the offense would score four times. Again, you're seeing MK Tedder step up to the plate, lower half of the lineup with six hits on the day. Yeah, Texas with a number of hits in that inning. Burke, Ellsworth. Tedder, Corona, I mean everybody chipping in as the Longhorns again scored four in the fifth to put them up 8-1. And that was really all they would need as Taylor Ellsworth worked with her second extra base hit of the contest. And in the seventh inning, Shea O'Leary finishing off the Lobos as Texas takes the finale 8-1, sweeping the three-game set against New Mexico and improving to 20-3 on the year.